Ohio men's basketball is coming off a quality win this past Saturday against Ball State and rolling right into Tuesday night's game here in Athens against Western Michigan. Hi there, I'm Abigail Clark, and with me today is Curtis Fader from WAB Bobcast Showcase. Now, Curtis, what overall stood out last Saturday for the Bobcats? Well, the increased effort as a whole from the Bobcats was evident throughout the entire game against Ball State. They were aggressive on the boards, relentless on defense, and won as a collective with five players reaching double figures. It was a game where everyone contributed, and the team looked always in control, which is a sign for good things to come for the rest of the season. Now, Curtis, looking ahead to Tuesday's game, what should we be expecting between these two teams, and how can the Bobcats continue their success this week? Well, Abby, first and foremost, Ohio needs to be fit and ready because starting Tuesday, they're going to be playing three games in a seven day span. Against Western Michigan, the Bobcats are definitely favored in this matchup at home. The Broncos are winless on the road and are poor in every statistical category, with their best stat being 206th in field goal percentage. Ohio's best path to victory is to continue distributing the ball efficiently as a nationally ranked top 10 team in assists and force Western Michigan to make more mistakes as they are one of the worst teams in Division I in turnovers. Minus a lapse in preparation and execution, this should be a very winnable game for the Bobcats. Ohio is currently down in the MAC rankings. Now, Curtis, how can the Bobcats make a move up the table and gain some momentum this last month of the season? Well, Ohio is down in the rankings for now, but it's actually a lot closer than you think. The Bobcats are conference win away from jumping three spots in the MAC and have an easier schedule in the home stretch against weaker opponents with losing records. But some tougher matchups to look for in the future are going to be their rematches against Akron and Bowling Green. But the way this team's been looking, I do not see how they could not make a push for the MAC title. Be sure to tune in on all of our Bobcast Showcase social media platforms as our reporters will keep you up to date with Tuesday night's game. Tip off a set for 6 o'clock. I'm Abigail Clark, logging out with Curtis Vader.